Patriots and or you got a Jerry Rice Super Bowl on the 50. No numbering that I can see on that one. Still a pretty cool card and a Shane Ray base rookie. He's holding up the jersey. Last one. I don't know if there's any short prints in this one, so I'll have to take a look, make sure we don't have any variants. Last pack is Forte, LaShawn McCoy, got a refractor of Odell Beckham, and then a Randy Gregory base. Okay. So good rookies, but man, that auto was a bust. You know it's bad when you're the one getting the autograph and you're still saying it's a bust. So yeah. Next up, we're going to do the other multi-pack one. we got Topps Platinum. Seems like we break one of these a year at least. And it kind of follows the old uh, SP Authentic format, which is lunch packs and nothing in them, and then like three woohoos basically. Your th uh, two autos and one patch auto. So many packs are in this one? 20 packs. So again, got a lot of, a lot of busting to do on this one. Basically, stopping for the highlights. And we go from there. So I've seen some really nice patch out autos out of here. Haven't seen anything this year though, so I don't really know what they look like. So got like a team logo in the background, the foil situation. That's Levante David, Jared Allen, Matt Ryan. Oh, I see. They're going for the uh, the gold cards, which are basically. Just the doofuses in disguise. It's C.J. Mosley, the T.J. Yeldon rookie. Even with that, the pack autos tend to stick out like a sore thumb on these. So I'll try to save it. Rivers, Jeffrey. We've got a Sean Mannion rookie, Kenny Bell X Factor rookie, and Darrell Rivas gold. So a bunch of inserts in that one. Still no one in the chat room. I gotta say. Kind of a slow night. Lamar Miller, Lacey, Ertz. We've got a Tyler Lockett base rookie and a Jordan Cameron gold. I think we got a die cut in here. Someone's fallen out of the pack, basically. Indeed we do, and a good one at that. So we got Frank Gore and Julian Edelman. Our die cut is what is it called platinum players Peyton Manning if you're gonna get an insert that's the guy to get and then we've got Robert Quinn Gold and a Matt Jones base rook Terrell Suggs Chandler Jones this is probably an autograph it's backwards indeed it is uh, for the uh, Eagles so I'm batting a thousand so far. Forty-six out of one fifty. Ugh, that's a rough auto for Nelson Aguilar. It's basically an end. All right. And then we've got a Justin Forsett gold and a Devin Funches space rookie. So one auto down, two auto or uh, one auto in the auto cash. Fadden, Murray, McCoy, got a gold of Peyton Manning and an Amari Cooper base rock. A couple of nice ones there. Roethlisberger, Aaron Rodgers, and another die cut. This one of Brashad Perriman. I don't know exactly what that one is. We got a gold of Randall Cobb and rookie of Stefan Diggs. Marcus Ware, Alfred Morris, breaking my heart over here. Uh, Arian Foster, gold of Mark Ingram, rookie of Tevin Coleman. Not a lot of numbers, not a lot of variants that I've seen so far. Our auto was a variant. I thought those used to be on card too. That one was a sticker. We got Hopkins, we got Demarius Thomas. We do have another autograph. It's a pretty good one. Pretty good names for the autographs. Sometimes the, the non-patch autos can be nobodies. Both of these were rookie premier guys. And this one for the Bills, non-numbered, but Carlos Williams. He, he played really well last year, so that's, that's a good hold, I'd say. 
And we got a gold of Greg Hardy and Garrett Grayson. Greg Hardy. I think Greg Hardy ended up playing for the Cowboys. Unless I'm thinking of someone different. Hmm. So we still got the patch auto. We've got Eli, Newton. Jamal Charles, J.J. Watt Gold, and a Ty Montgomery base. Joyke Bell, Antonio Gates. Got a Duke Johnson rookie, a Golden Tate Gold, and a Tyler Croft X Fractor. Quite a few going on in that pack. I think. We're seeing the patch auto, so I'll set that one aside here. So Jordan Reed, Golden Tate, JJ Watt, Jordan Reed Gold, Javoris Allen, base rookie. Since we've only got the one hit left, I'll try to power through these a little bit. So we got a Chris Conley X Fractor, Martellus Bennett Gold, Brashard Perriman, base rookie. Vaughn Miller base, Julius Thomas, Bronkowski, Devontae Parker, rookie, and a Marcel Darius. Gold. Honestly, I'd rather have the uh, just the, uh, the the dummy inserts, man. I could use a bunch of those. By the way, if anyone's watching this and they have a bunch, they can send me in a prepaid envelope or a prepaid mailer. Like I will I will pay for them. I need them for shipping and I am out. Uh, Jordan Matthews and Des Bryant. Got an Andrus Pete rookie, X Fractor, Tom Brady Gold, David Cobb rookie. It's funny how those things just gathered up and gathered up, and I couldn't get rid of them until I started doing the breaks, then I just can't keep them in my house. They're great for shipping. Stafford, Wilson, Cutler, Robert Griffin Gold, Marcus Mariota base. There you go. Nice rookie there, at least for the Mariota. I think I still got the. Patch auto picked out. We'll see. Flacco, Brandon Marshall. So we have a blue, which does not appear to be numbered. Justin Hardy. Jordy Nelson Gold and a Justin Hardy base. Jordan, I thought for sure the blue would have been numbered. Lynch, Giovanni Bernard, and upside down Jason Britton for some reason. Gold T.Y. Hilton and a Nelson Aguilar base rook. Two packs to go. And like I said, the patch kind of sticks out so it's easy to see. We'll do that last. Mathis and Dansby. Doriel Beckham Green, X Fractor. Matt Forte Gold, Max Williams base. And hopefully the big, big hit, the patch auto. Card right on top. And we have. That is a pretty nice patch, I will say. Maybe not the best player, but this one looked late, too. So for the Atlanta Falcons, 41-99, a guy who did show some promise in a really, really nice patch. Uh, Three-color, what is that going to be? I think a number? Oh, look at that, though. It's a very, very nice patch. Not a 99 for Tevin Coleman. That's a very nice hit for the Falcons. Again, Devonta Freeman kind of took over that backfield, but he was supposed to be the starter. So, I mean, again, another guy with some hold potential. Leonard Williams base and a Sammy Watkins gold finish that one. So, after doing a ton of packs, our last two boxes are basically just to hit every single pack. So these will go pretty quick. So first off, we've got 2015 Panini Playbook. Now, they've changed the format on this one a couple times. Right now, it's two packs, and everyone is a base playbook booklet. I heard about these. I hear they're kind of weird and flimsy. One autograph or memorabilia booklet and one additional autograph or memorabilia card. So it's basically two packs, two hits. At least I think it's two packs. Could just all be in one. I will say I kind of missed the one where it had four packs and it was like a giant pizza box. I don't know why. I always thought that was kind of hilarious. Slide, pull, what is that? Ah, here we go. So it is just one pack. So I'll try my best to go card by card. But I hear the base cards on these are kind of funny. Kind of flimsy. Let's 
weirdly, something's coming in a sleeve right off the top. I think that's the base. So let's see exactly what that is. Oh, that is weird. It's like a super flimsy, it's like a base card folded in half. Uh, 77 out of 199, it's uh, Ben Roethlisberger and Le'Veon Bell. I can see now why this was in a sleeve, because it's very, very flimsy. It's a neat idea. Um, maybe not the best execution in the universe, though, I will say. So, first card off the top, we have 29 of 49, and auto game use for the Packers. Ha ha, Clinton Dix. It's a pretty cool one. I don't think there's a lot of jersey cards from Mr. Clinton Dix. Yeah, game worn material. So I guess that's because it's a kind of a late season when they're actually able to get a game worn. So our booklet is admittedly kind of boring. So oh, 95 out of 199 for the Carolina Panthers. It's the dual memorabilia for Devin Funches. It's two big, big old swatches. <laughs> All right, that was kind of boring. Well, I know why that one was kind of deeply discounted. Anyway, this is really the main event. I know that a lot of people wanted to break this last month. I've been looking forward to it too. I've seen a lot of breaks online and this one looks good. So it's four packs and it comes down to one on-card autograph, one jumbo relic, one autograph relic, and one quad relic. And some of these are pretty nice. Checklist is deep. A lot of old names on it, too. I guess we're doing a mini box format on this. I did not realize, so let me slice them all open. So first up, man, I love their packing. The pack in a box, in a box. Eddie George, Titans, and kind of a, I don't know what I'd call that. I don't know what set that reminds me of, but it's a nice classic look to it. Eddie George, listed as a Titan. Terrell Davis, Max Williams, rookie. Rob Gronkowski at a 99 in our first hit. Uh, I know who that's going to. That's a pretty cool one. So a guy who has not been getting a ton of hits as of late... Uh, one of our guys from across the Atlantic, Flea. I want to say 276 out of 350 on card, Kevin White autograph. This is another one that I'd classify as a hold. Obviously, he didn't play due to being injured all year, but he, draft, he got drafted pretty darn high, so that could be a big one. Just depends on what he looks like this next year. Back to Alshon Jeffrey at a 60. Justin Forsett, Devin Smith, CJ Anderson. We do have our second auto right off the bat. That means our next two are the memorabilia ones. So going for the Jets. Unfortunately, this is probably one of the worst players we could pull for this one. High draft pick, but a defensive player. 16 of 50, Leonard Williams. Triple game use auto for the Jets. Good draft hit. But, I mean, obviously you're hoping for like a Mariota, Winston, Amari Cooper, one of those big guys there. So we're looking for a big memorabilia to you know, right the ship on this one. We've got David Johnson, Teddy Bridgewater, John Elway. We have a canvas collection. That's for... Ah, Amir Abdullah. I didn't know who that was. Neat looking card. Portrait looking guy there. So, 11 and 99. A curiously dirty swatch, all things considered. The guy who didn't play at all, Garrett Grayson, for the Saints. Ah, uh, this is not the best of these boxes I've seen. So we're really hoping for the quad memorabilia to kind of pull us out of this one. Not the best month we've had, I will admit. Platinum is pretty good. 
the rest of it. I, I guess we're hoping for some crazy batches. So we have Odell Beckham. Can't tell if that's a variation or not. Set her aside. Jamal Charles, Mariota base rookie. That's pretty good. Emmett Smith. And our last of the hits. Ooh. Oh, okay, well, I will say this is this is a pretty disgusting patch. So I don't think it makes up for everything. But for the person with the Jaguars, they're probably gonna be pretty happy. Uh, 12 of 25. Rashad Green quad jersey. But man, check out that one on the right. That's a beaut. Got the JA and the Jaguars right there. That's pretty nice. Don't see a patch of that quality every single day, I'm going to say. So, let's do a quick recap. One of our best of months, I will say. So, obviously, got the big patch right there from Rashad Green at 25. That's one of our better hits. Got the Grayson at 99. Uh, probably not the guy you're looking for. Leonard Williams. I mean, I'd be happy with that if I were the Jets guy, but there's a lot of Autographs in the checklist I think you'd rather have. Again, the Kevin White could be a good one. Kind of a wait and see, but a nice on-card auto. Uh, the Funchess booklet. It's two swatches. The Clinton Dix is pretty nice. What's that one? Uh, 49, so it's pretty low for one, too. The Coleman is nice. It's a really cool patch. Our two other ones were not bad. Good skill players, Aguilar and Carlos Williams. So the Platinum, I would say, was our best box of the bunch. And then, wah, wah, that Chrome got skunked with the Josh Harper. So, I mean, it's like some of our other breaks. You win some, you lose some. I'll get pictures on that one posted. We'll get things sent out as soon as possible. Guys, I appreciate you being a part of the breaks. And uh, you know, with this last one, I, I think we'll probably do one more break of the 15, uh, 2015 stuff. Sometimes, as we're kind of winding down, we're doing one of the last months of the uh, product year, we might double up and do like a case. So maybe we give it a shot. We'll talk about it later. But as always, I appreciate you joining. And uh, yeah, thanks for watching.